Yeah, four players left in winners. Core Gem vs. Swoop will be the first of the two. Yeah, and on the other side of winners, we have Black Sage and THTB614. So, I don't know. I don't know Black Sage, I don't think. Uh, Black Sage was in last week's um, was in last week's bracket. He had a very solid showing, made it pretty far. I want to say he placed fourth. Do you know what character he plays? Uh, I'm trying to think. We had a ton of Urians last week, so I want to say he plays Urian. I could be wrong. Okay, so it'd be Urian versus Sakura, and what I assume is. is Laura versus Abigail. That's our top eight winner side. M most... It it could very well be Laura versus versus Abigail. I'm not sure if Corey prefers another character for the Abigail matchup besides Laura. Could he could go for Seth? He could be the people's champ and play Seth, but no, he's going to play Laura because Corey's lame. Or I feel like Laura's definitely better online. So Corey, I <laughs> I'd imagine that Corey's just a little bit more confident in his Laura. Oh, for sure. Corey. Like, Maybe in the first round of Grand Finals, you might see something different before that. Might, Perhaps. There's a chance Corey might mess around a little bit. I think there's too many good players in this tournament that he's worried about. For him to take one of his less practice options. It seems to be the right choice so far. These punches, falls in the tire. Oh man, the tire even covering <laughs> Corey Jam trying to jump over. Tire just does so much for this character. Yep, that's death. That's one thing that David Swift has shown in his match against Big Boots earlier on stream. Just how much command and control he can get over the match just with that single tire. Yeah, he did the same thing to me our entire match. It's a... Uh... It's a weird option. It's a tool that commands respect in the neutral. Yeah, it's really good, especially for Abigail. Oh. So Courtney, I'm starting to get his pressure going. Not giving him much room to try and send out another tire, with the exception of him throwing out another EX Abigail punch, which Corey responds in kind with an Abigail EX elbow. Tire, but he's back inside. That should be it. Yep. yep. It is. Crouching short tick throw into command grab. It works. Final round. Yeah, Fight. everything's true. Line. Everything is true. <laughs> no, nothing has ever been more true. The netcode seems slightly better for this game, but it's still not great. But let's hope that the that the uh, the matchmaking patch that will be coming in in just three days will. Change things up a little bit. We can only hope. So Corey gets through the tire with thanks to the uh, invincibility of the command grab animation. Corey just respects the tire, just sits back and blocks it. Sends out a projectile of his own. So Corey Jam managing to close the gap, get a little bit of his offense going. Lance a crush counter flip. Lance with another flip, gets short into elbow, goes for a stun. And that'll be the first game for Core Jam. That was close. It was very evenly contested. Yeah, able to get the blender out off of a single bolt pretty much, but... Abigail is a character that requires you to maintain his madness. Yeah. Like, if you're not... If you're not playing a character that you can use to cop contain Abigail's options, you're going to get absolutely steamrolled. Yeah, you have to be able to keep up with your pace. We're just going up with just like dash of command grab. Called it tire at the first moment. I almost feel like Swoops wasn't ready. Or he just playing it patient, just crouching under the giant flip. He didn't care. Didn't want anti-air, didn't want to try and interrupt it, just crouch under it. Oh, no. Swoops? 
back in the one three goes. So Swoops now has a single bar of meter. He he tried to interrupt that sequence with an EX Abigail punch, but wasn't quite able to make it through Core Jam's pressure. Core Jam making it through to uh, set point. To get the grab to the Ooh, what? Oh, the reverse. <laughs> Makes him feel more honest. Nothing about these characters are honest. There's no, there's no good honest character. <laughs> Especially in this game. Ooh, Corey with a solid interruption on the giant flip with the stand medium kick. Getting the blender going. Almost got the stun. What's, what's he gonna do on Oki? Who's for another stand medium kick? Stand medium kick. So Swoop's setting up for the VT2. You can't escape. Final round. Slams his chest into the wall. <laughs> Both players being very patient in how they approach the third round. Patience is pretty much what Swoops wants. Anytime Boris not chopping into bits, it's for him. Win condition. Oh. That's it. That's it. That's a that's a dead Laura. So David Swoops taking it for game number two, tying up the set one one. Abigail's Abigail like, oh, wins. Easy. You can't blend tires. They're too big. <laughs> the material's awful. It'll destroy the blades. Let's match up 60-40 Abigail for that we need, alone. We need an industrial blender. <laughs> Will it blend? The answer is no. <laughs> <laughs> Round one. All right, moving uh, to set three. Look at that robot. I actually didn't know that the costume code did that. I had no idea this costume was kind of code. So, the, even if a bunch of these costumes didn't have the code at launch, they eventually went back and added some of the codes later. You really gotta respect the VT2 from, from Abigail whenever he does the sequence. Any any confirm into a special can just be cancelled right into the VT2, but Corjan was ready after the first instance. Yeah, What's after being swatted out of the air by him twice. Able to get over him. Already in at the beginning. Uh, he's trying to close this out quick. You, you don't. Because Ab Abigail has the far advantage. As Sun Tzu once said, nothing can be gained from prolonged conflict. That cannot be more true than against this character. You you want Abigail to die, and you want him to die fast. Yeah, but it's gonna be really hard for Swoops to get his opponent to beat himself. As Sun Tzu would also recommend. <laughs> Corey's been an online Laura as long as there's been online and Laura. <laughs> and both appear to be going out stupendously well for him. Core Jam taking it 2 1 over David Swoops. That was a very close match. Really good in game two. That was a really close match. Like game two, he looked great, but I feel like by game three, Corey was just. He was done. <laughs> Or he had just figured it out. He didn't care how hard it was to blend. He was going to make it work. <laughs>